A spoon appears bent when placed in a glass of water because light changes speed as it moves from air into water, bending at the interface due to the difference in refractive index. The same principle applies to paint. When the refractive indices of the pigment and binder are closely matched, light passes through unhindered, resulting in transparency. However, when the refractive indices differ significantly, light scatters, creating opacity. Transparent pigments such as alizarin crimson, ultramarine blue, and viridian have refractive indices closer to that of linseed oil, which has a RI of approximately 1.48. This allows more light to pass through the glaze rather than being scattered or reflected within the paint layer. By minimizing refraction, these pigments help create the luminous depth characteristics of well-executed glazes. Adding extender pigments like chalk, silica, or barite to paint can also increase transparency. These finely ground materials have refractive indices between 1.5 and 1.6, which is close to that of oil. Because their optical properties closely match the surrounding binder, they reduce light scattering and help pigments maintain their transparency. This makes them particularly useful for controlling transparency while also helping to build texture and bulk in a paint layer. The best glazes are built up in thin layers. The thinner the film, the less light is absorbed and the more light passes through, creating that luminous effect. Thin layers of color can be applied by spreading the paint with a stiff hair brushes or wiping away excess paint. Stiff hair brushes let you apply thin layers of paint straight from the tube without the need for adding more oil or medium. Another method is to apply a small amount of paint and then wipe away the excess with the rag, leaving behind a transparent film. Get more tips about oil paint glazing at naturalpigments.com.